Hello YouTube, this is Dazza the Cameraman. Today is Tuesday the 20th of August 2013 and this is a follow-up video to some comments that I left on the 00, Zero Skyview channel under this video, Ison and the Cyclical Change Ahead. About seven days I put some questions uh, to the uh, Skyview and promised them that I would be following up uh, their response with a video. First of all, let's have a look at the uh, questions uh, that I put to them under this video. Um, first of all, um, here, here are some screenshots of uh, some comments. I'm having to show you screenshots here because as you can see, um, to start with, uh, they do screen comments on the Skyview channel and they only publish comments that they want you to see and um, subsequently several of my comments were actually deleted so uh, let's have a look at some of the comments that I've left I told them that I, uh, I'm going to give you an opportunity to give clear and honest answers to the questions that people would want to know if your KBO was real you know KBO is what they claim is a Kuiper belt object I said I can give you the current and future Radek coordinates of Comet Ison or Pluto or Eris etc at any time you request. This would allow you to aim your telescopes at the target and find any of these objects. Now I challenge you to tell me the Radek coordinates for your Kuiper Belt object for the next seven days. I will be publishing your response or lack of it if you fail to answer. So this comment was subsequently published under this video and then it was subsequently deleted later on. Um, now they did reply to this uh, comment and their reply up the top here uh, they said uh, Dazza the cameraman do whatever you want at this point in the game we could care less what you debunk on your channel it seems that's what your channel is all about you'll never scare us like you did to Nettie uh, referring to Nettie Flanders again we don't care debunk what you want with our blessings and um, I replied to that comment and I said in addition to my question above I ask you to state the following information 1. the estimated size of your Kuiper Belt object in kilometers or miles 2. its current distance from the Sun in AU 3. its current distance from the Earth in AU 4. its current angular size 5. its current apparent magnitude Again, I am publishing your response, or lack of, far and wide. If you can answer these questions correctly, it will be to your credit and advantage. If not, you will lose all credibility. And again they replied, Dazza the cameraman, do whatever you want. At this point in the game, we could care less what you debunk on your channel and uh, I think that's the same one that I responded on before. have to remember that some of these uh, comments have been deleted by the Skyview so things are a little bit out of order. I replied to that comment, well it's up to you but if you want to retain any credibility at all you will want to answer the questions that people would expect you to be able to answer. That is if you are really tracking such an object and really are the experts you are making yourself out to be. I intend to follow up on this with a response video. You can either be seen to be providing the information people want to know or be seen as a fraud and disinfo agent that can't answer simple questions just like Nettie can't. And when I went to post uh, this comment uh, I got this message here to say oops you cannot respond to a deleted comment. So they had actually deleted their response to me which meant that I couldn't actually comment or I couldn't actually reply on that comment. So what I did was I copied and I reposted um, my response as a separate comment and that was subsequently published and we can see the Skyview's response uh, under this published comment. We told you to debunk the video, we really don't care, you have our blessings, there are people like you under every rock. I responded by saying if you don't really care then why did you find it necessary to delete or censor my previous comments and questions I asked 
In addition to my question above, I ask you to state the following information. The estimated size of your KBO in kilometres or miles, its current distance from the Sun in AU, its current distance from the Earth in AU, its current angular size, its current apparent magnitude. I will be, am, publishing your response or lack of to these questions. And uh, they responded finally by saying, this is the last response to you. When you asked, you were very rude, unprofessional, like a child running rampant, threatening to run all over YouTube to debunk the video as you have done to many. Debunk it. Only those that choose to believe you will. Those that don't will not, Mr. Captain Video Ranger. Next time try to be professional, an email you request might have gotten you what you wanted. So there's their response and um, to date we've had no response to these questions that were put to them. Um, there are the questions there that I just read back and we've had no response and I'm pleased to tell you that um, a team of astronomers, um, friends of mine, um, we are putting together a response video to the team view and we will be blowing the lid on their claims or his claims and um, we're going to bring you some information that is going to be quite shocking so stay posted for that video we still wait to hear back from uh, the sky view and if I hear any response from them I will let you know but in the meantime we have got a video in the pipeline it will be uploaded very soon so stay tuned for that Thank you for watching, as always check out my Facebook discussion page Voices of Reason to Explain X or Vortex, I'll put a link for you in the description area. Thank you.